it makes some strange sounds. Today we are going to listen to the electromagnetic radiation in the streets of our city. Electromagnetic radio waves are received by the radiation sensitive detail, intensified by the frame and can be detected as sounds we can hear. Let's try outside. I can hear. Most probably the mass radiates them. Let's go to the city. The radiation is not really so intensive on the outskirts. We can only hear those signals that masts radiate. Also we can hear those signals that the motorcycle radiates. Let's try to receive the cell phone tower signal. It's not used very frequently. Let's go, it's really dangerous in our city. That's why we are leaving. I want to remind you that we have military operations conducted in our city. That is why don't get surprised to see so few people. Almost everybody moved out. The radiation is really intensive next to the mast. Just like the radiation of 100 cell phones, the radiation is also intensive in the square. Let's go further, to the Voroshilov Memorial. Let us climb the roof to check which antenna radiates more intensively. We've got lots of antennas here, sectoral, relay ones, we've also got some strange antennas. And the wind toppled those antennas. The antenna warning warns us of non-ionization. It's nano bridge antenna. It's used for transmitting internet data. The electromagnetic radiation of this antenna is tens of times more intensive than of the rest ones. The noise is heard not only all over the roof, but also on the last floors of the building. It makes really strange sounds. Check the next one. And the last one too. Dear network providers, please set the antenna straight. It bends over the windows of the neighboring house, so their electrical appliances make electrical voltage bus sound effect. Now it's established that in most parts of the city, radiation isn't intensive and can be hardly detected. But in some places with cell towers, it's much more intensive. Sometimes it even causes failures. Subscribe for our channel, visit our community in VK. In one of our next videos we are going to measure the radiation of an opened and running microwave.